So Tom, tell me about your goals for the session that you just led. There are a couple of goals. One is, I think the, the main goal is that you trick the kids into doing arithmetic. <laughs> it, it, it's sort of funny. They, they, they think they're solving a sort of a rope puzzle, but in fact, what they're doing is they're drilling their arithmetic with positive and negative fractions and arithmetic on it. Mm -hmm. I mean, obviously, you want to show the kids that mathematics is hooked up to... Uh, is hooked up to physical situations in surprising mm -hmm. ways, and, and this is a good example of that, too. Right, right. Mm -hmm. Great. So how do you think it went today? I, I think it went pretty well. Yeah. Um, I'm always terrified <laughs> <laughs> that, the, that, the, that the tangle, the final tangle in the bag isn't going to work. When you're doing the tangle and it's open, you can sort of see that you're making progress and things are right. getting simpler, but in the bag thing, you never know. So I like it that way. It's okay. exciting for me as well as for the audience. <laughs> <laughs> oh, very good. Um, are, is there anything that you would do differently next time? Um, yeah, maybe. I think I, I spent too much time with the groups working by themselves, but that seemed good. I mean, there was a lot of action there. There are a couple things I would have liked to have gotten to that I didn't, but I, I always run out of stuff. Yeah, right out of yeah, time. Yeah, I, I need like four hours. <laughs> <laughs> right, right, right. Um, and what kind of advice would you give to somebody who was going to lead a session on Conway's Rational Tangles? Well, practice it at home. <laughs> <laughs> um, that's the main thing. And uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, make sure that you can do the arithmetic and, and, and you've got that down. And, and if you've got kids or adults doing it, make sure that you've got some people checking your work and checking each other's work and so forth because mm -hmm. it, it's really bad because one tiny error and it just doesn't work out mm -hmm. any small error and, and you're out of business so right. really uh, be rigorous about the arithmetic mm -hmm. <laughs> oh very good anything else you want to add about the session um, no it's one of my favorite sessions and, and it's nice that you can use it at almost any level you can teach group theory to college kids, or you could teach uh, arithmetic to to younger kids. I mean, and in fact, maybe they hadn't even seen negative numbers. This is a really nice way of doing it, where mm -hmm. um, you know, a negative of something is something that is undone with positive operations and so forth. Mm -hmm. Great. Well, thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Welcome. Is there anything you want to do again, or or add, or anything, or are you happy? Um, I'm happy, I guess. I'm happy too. <laughs> <laughs> okay, great. Okay. Thank you so much.